this is Mark from Two Dog RC, and today we're going to talk about how to braid motor wires. This is really nice for your quad, it adds a real nice feature, and also adds some strength. Well, here's a motor that I recently did, and Carly here will tell you why this one isn't a good motor braid. Carly? Well, this one isn't a good motor braid because it's loose, it's not neat, and it won't hold wires tight. It's not strong. So how about we show these guys how to make a good motor braid? How's that sound? Okay. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to take one of the outside of wires. It doesn't matter which one, just not the middle one. And you're going to cross it over and then pull. And then cross the other middle one and the other outside one in and then pull. And then cross this outside one in and pull. other the, this outside one and pull and then you just do that for the whole wire until you're done so you get to the very bottom and you, d you don't have any more wire to braid like you can't braid it anymore. okay and Carly how do you make it tighter how do you make the braid look tighter and neater what's you, the trick you just have to pull it that's basically all you yeah. okay you pull you just go pull well you have to hold the middle wire down usually and then pull and then hold them both down and then go under. See? Excellent. And then, like, see, that's what it looks like if you don't pull. So then when I pull it, it looks a lot neater. Okay. So this is the finished product of what it looks like when you're done braiding on the motor wire. And it will allow your motor wire to be stronger and your quadcopter to look a lot neater. If you want to buy one of these, you can go to my dad's website at twodogrc.com. 